Hey everybody, I'm Chris Peru in the North Conway studio. You're watching White Mountains Today, where we help you have fun in the White Mountains by bringing in the experts. Let's go now to King Pine Ski Area at Purity Spring Resort and join Thomas Prindle. Hi, Thomas. Good morning, Chris. Thank you for having me on as always. Uh, super excited. We're here at the base of the Black Bear Chairlift at King Pine Ski Area, and we're 100% open, all trails ready to go for the February vacation week. Okay, I was going to make that my first question because I did some traveling earlier this week and once you get below the lakes region, there's not a lot of snow. So many people may be wondering first and foremost, is there snow in the White Mountains? Yes, I can confirm there is snow in the White Mountains for sure. Yeah, I think if you look at some of those snow-based depth charts that meteorologists uh, might share, you can see that our area, especially the White Mountains area, uh, has a significant amount of snow. So yeah, for sure, if you're watching this from from somewhere south of uh, the White Mountains or the Mount Washington Valley area, uh, you might be a little concerned, but like I said, King Pine Ski Area, we're 100% all trails open, and uh, we're ready to operate daily from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., and we'll have our snow tubing operating daily as well from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., so uh, the winter fun is here, and uh, we're going to get through this little bit of warm weather, and then winter's definitely going to return. If we know anything about New England, <laughs> if you don't like the weather now, just wait another five minutes, but for sure, generally, uh, we'll get some more winter this way. It's absolutely true. And looking over your shoulder, you can see the great terrain. Again, 100% open. You might be one of a few or perhaps even the only resort 100% open in the state of New Hampshire. But we also see uh, a wide variety of terrain back there from advanced to beginner. So no matter what your skill level, you'll find something for you at King Pine. Yeah, I totally agree with that. We do have a great variety of trails and terrain. We're certainly known as a smaller ski area and we're a great ski area for families, young children and, and children of all ages to learn. Uh, skiing and snowboarding. We have an incredible uh, PSIA snow sports instructional school uh, that can really just kind of uh, get people uh, into the passion of skiing and snowboarding. But just as you said, we also have a variety of terrain that's going to keep everyone interested. Uh, we have an incredible King Pine race team. They do a lot of training here on the backside trails. And uh, But yeah, just like you said, it's, it's a lot of great terrain and we have our terrain park now open. Uh, there's about seven small to medium sized terrain park freestyle box rail and snow elements that people can uh, do a little freestyle jibbing on but uh, yeah we have a lot, we have it all here we're speaking with thomas prindle of king pine ski area at purity spring resort thomas what are your vacation week hours again yeah so as i mentioned just a little bit ago uh, for the vacation week our lifts will begin at 9 a.m all lifts will be scheduled and then we'll operate until 6 p.m daily we do shut down the black bear and the uh, bear rug carpet lift but we continue to operate uh, the polar bear the powder bear and the cubby tow rope, and we maintain our 10 front side trails all illuminated for night twilight skiing. And uh, it can be really beautiful to check out the twilight uh, just as the sun is setting and as lights start to come on. It's a really unique experience. And then the other aspect of that is what we do offer twilight lift tickets from 3.30 to 6 p.m. And it's a very affordable way to get out and make some uh, runs as, as the evening light sets. Uh, and we have rental equipment available. We also will have our tubing uh, operations open till 6 p.m. daily. So, um, you know, don't give up on the day when it's 3.30 or 4 p.m. Uh, we're still going until 6 p.m. daily. What a great idea. So we've got skiing, we've got tubing, and I understand you're going to make it even more festive with some Spirit Week activities. You could even win some lift tickets. Yeah, so this was a concept that our rental and tune shops used to do weekly during the February vacation week, just to kind of bolster the enthusiasm of our staff and teams. They would choose theme days and get dressed up for those theme days. Uh, so our current rental shop manager came up with the idea. He said, why don't we do this for all of our departments and then also open it up to the public? So if you go to our website right now on our event calendar, you'll see that there's theme days designated for every day of the vacation week, whether it's like decorating your helmet or dressing up like a superhero or dressing up like a pirate. There's all these different theme days going on. And for the general public, if you, if you participate in this, uh, you get entered into a raffle, and we're giving away a pair of lift tickets valid for next season every day of the week. So uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So people are just just to be aware that uh, you might see some of our team members dressed up in costume. Again, it's a busy week for us. Uh, our teams are working hard. It's 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 a good time, but uh, we're trying to get everyone involved with just making it a nice festive February vacation week. That sounds like a lot of fun. And it's not a vacation for me unless after a day of skiing I can enjoy some live music. You've got some of that coming up and also a comedy show, I understand. Yeah, we've been doing live music every Saturday up in the Trails and Tavern every afternoon from 3 to 6 p.m. Uh, but in addition to that, we've got some other unique events scheduled. Uh, we're going to have Bucky Lewis doing a comedy show on Wednesday evening. This is the 21-plus age 
event. Uh, that's on Wednesday night from 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. There is a $20 door cover charge for that event. But then also on the Thursday evening, we do have free music, live music, uh, with a special band um, playing up there Thursday in addition to the Saturday night. So it should be a good time going on up there. So much happening at King Pine Ski Area. Thomas, anything we missed? No, just want to make people aware, you know, definitely snow tubing is an opportunity to get out and enjoy some winter fun. Uh, we also have another guided snowshoe tour with Tin Mountain Conservation Center. That's scheduled for Wednesday, February 22nd. Our cross-country trails are not the best for Nordic skiing right now, but they certainly are, you know, some great adventurous snowshoeing out there to take part in. And that guided snowshoe tour set for Wednesday is going to be a great event. And what's your recommendation on getting tickets? Should they book online in advance? Yeah, so for the guided snowshoe tour, they can call and get their name on that. There's limited spots available for that uh, to participate in. And all the information is going to be available at kingpine.com, especially if they check out the available event calendar. And last but not least, where are you located? How do people find King Pine Ski Area? Uh, we are located in Madison, New Hampshire on Route 153, uh, just about 15 minutes south of North Conway. And uh, yeah, come check us out and you can find all the information available at kingpine.com. Easy to find, beautiful, scenic. Thank you so much for joining us, Thomas. Have a great vacation week. You too. You're watching White Mountains Today.